a treasure chest opened and spilled its precious contents on the floor. Remove the loops. Install a lid and a bottom on top of each other. Install cardboard walls and the ceiling. Complete the set with decorative inserts. Wooden skewers from an old fan perfectly match the craft. Paint everything bright red. This doll theater will get everyone's attention. The gorgeous curtain is ready to open. The figurines of shadow puppets are moving around thanks to toothpicks. The light goes down and a legendary play from director Olaf will come to life in front of your eyes. Olaf prepared a show a long time ago. He planned everything. This is the last rehearsal before the show. Hello. The girls are excited to see a wonderful show and they're watching the figurines. I can't wait for it to start. <laughs> Me neither. Can you believe it? It's a real home theater. What story will we see today? Make yourselves comfortable. The show is about to begin. The sisters were happy to see a light come on in the window. Yay! In the kingdom far, far away, called Arendelle, there lived two sisters. One day they decided to create a snowman to have a friend so they could play together. Did you enjoy the show? We did. You deserve a standing ovation. <laughs> we need to do it again. We can use cardboard of different colors for our new crafts. Mark the cutting lines and folding lines. Make openings so the page is 3D. Glue on a base. We have a whole forest of pine trees. The tree branches are covered in snow. Wow, fresh grass. What a quick change of seasons. The butterflies are already flapping their bright wings. It's spring on this page. Put together quilling strips to make a rainbow ribbon. A rainbow appeared above the clouds. What a happy picture. Glue on the page to make a book of fairy tales. The babies will love it. The children couldn't fall asleep. They had a pillow fight and they were laughing and jumping on their beds. Oh, you little ones. Olaf heard the noise and decided to distract the kids. I got a great idea. He immediately came back with a beautiful book. What do you think it is? I don't know, a surprise maybe? Olaf brought an armchair, sat down and opened the book. The kids were looking at the new pictures with great interest. Wow. Olaf was telling a fairy tale in such an interesting way. The sisters got so carried away that they forgot about misbehaving. It's time to go to sleep. The snowman tucked Anna and Elsa in. Have rainbow dreams, girls. Thank you. He turned the light off. Oh, I'm melting, melting. Why is it so hot? <gasps> oh no, get rid of this heater. We need to cool you down ASAP. Remove the gel from a diaper. Pour it inside a little pool and add water. When it gets wet, it looks like snow. Let's play with snowballs. Whoa. Anna and Elsa couldn't fall asleep. Shall we go to the big room? Just shh, it will be our little secret. The girls went to the biggest room in the castle. It's so spacious. Elsa, make lots of snow. Fill the rectangular container with water. Rhinestones, snowflakes, crystals, and a chair. It's all going in the water. It's okay if they sink. The ice will look very beautiful. Yay, we made a whole ice block. The moonlight comes through in such a beautiful way. The frozen slide looks so beautiful. Baby Elsa has the unique talent to freeze everything around her. She conjured piles of snow and an ice slide. The girls started playing with snowballs. That's so fun! Then they made a big snowman, and they even made snow angels. 
And don't forget about the main entertainment, sliding down an ice slide. Oh, the girls are gonna have so much fun. Suddenly, something bad happened. Anna slid down too hard and hurt herself. <gasps> what did I do? Oh, my gift almost killed my sister. Why didn't I save her? <laughs> a sheet of thick cardboard turns into a door frame. Apply Elmer's glue. Glue on one more sheet. Four rectangular pieces will come in handy. Paint everything white. Decorate the door with carvings. An ancient handle is covered in silver. Attach door hinges. Where did this door lead? Bye, Anna. I'd better stay alone so I don't hurt anyone. I'll miss you a lot. Elsa stayed in her room. Anna always came to her door and talked to Elsa a lot. She sat next to the door and told about her daily adventures, but she only heard silence in return. Elsa didn't want to talk because she was scared of hurting her sister. Many years went by. The girls grew up, but the door between them stayed. The coronation day was approaching. Elsa opened the door. I've been waiting for so many years. Sorry, I only did it to protect you. I love you, sister. I love you too. <laughs> we can use this metal ring next. Take some lace from a broken toy. Attach it to the arc. Cover the crown in gold. It's gorgeous! And then it was coronation day. There were so many guests at the party. Anna was so excited to see Elsa. Today, her sister will become the ruler of Arendelle. Welcome the new queen. Anna carefully put the crown on Elsa's head. Now the whole kingdom belongs to her. Shape an ice ridge out of hot glue. It's a frozen natural miracle. Paint it with acrylic spray paint. It's like the ice is sparkling from the inside. Elsa hasn't learned to fully control her power. The smallest emotion can freeze everything around her. The queen tried to run away from guests. I beg you, don't come any closer. Go away. You don't know how much danger you're in. Elsa got angry. She whirled around and froze a fountain. It froze and turned into ice. Elsa got scared of her powers and ran away. Anna followed her. Hucks, gears, decorations. We have a lot of work to do. Glue on a screen to the detail. Hmm. Cover it with a protective lens. Hang it on an accessory chain with a carabiner. Wow. The arrow points north. Anna decided to follow her heart, but it's safer to rely on the compass. Anna went searching for Elsa. Her fiance, Hans, followed her. Honey, I will not allow you to risk your life, but finding my sister is what I have to do. I understand. I'll do everything I can. Thanks to this compass, you can find your way. And this loyal horse will help you get where you need to go. What would I do without you? Thank you. Hans put a cloak over Anna's shoulders so she doesn't get cold. Thank you. Watch over Arendelle and take care of our people. I trust you. Bye. The couple said their goodbyes and Anna went searching. Separate brown fabric like this. Sew a bag. A carrot harvest is ready. We managed to collect a whole bag. There will be something to snack on during the trip. Anna is going further and further into the forest. Soon there will be no trees and I will not be able to look around. But the horse <gasps> threw the girl off and ran away. Oh no, Anna was left cold and alone. 
What's that, a house for travelers? I need to look inside. It's a shop. Can I stay here to warm up? Of course, you need warmer clothes. Do you have something I can use? Warm boots with artificial fur and lots of clothes. Hmm, I can use this. Suddenly, a guy came inside the shop to buy a rope for mountain climbing and a carrot to feed his deer. I hope I have enough money. Now we'll count it. Hmm, this coin isn't enough. Hmm. Oh my gosh, will Sven really have to go hungry? <sighs> Bye. Have pity on him. Give him those things. I'll pay for everything. She decided to help him. Hello. Does this belong to you? Thanks. Oh, lady, how can I thank you? Help me find my sister. That's a noble thing to do. Deal. My name is Anna. And I'm Kristoff. Make a mountain climbing rope out of cords, attachments, and carabiners. The attachment should easily slide along the rope, and the carabiners should be strong enough to hold our heroes. Did you hear that noise? I hope it's not an avalanche. But they didn't have a clue who was really roaring. A marshmallow giant was guarding Elsa's castle, and he's not planning on letting anyone into the queen's territory. Ah, run! New plan, I'll distract him and throw this ball. And Anna threw a snowball too. Grrr. Now you made him mad. <gasps> That's where we'll need the rope. We have to slide down. The confused giant stayed on top. Anna and Kristoff successfully reached the ground. Shoo. We'll need this wooden base to make a sled. The board separates into sticks. Let's use them for rails. Paint the sled to look like dark wood. The rails are metallic. Gold ornaments decorate the sides of the sled. The rails will hold the reindeer. Fortunately, Kristoff has a sled. The friends got on and went searching for Elsa. Wait, who could have left this ice garland here? Hmm. The deer managed to sniff out something unusual, a carrot. Whoa. Olaf friend, where did your nose go? Here, I knew I had this carrot for a reason. <laughs> Put snowballs on a bent wire. What a weird dish, who came up with this recipe? Olaf also went searching for Elsa. He was so tired of waiting, and he got hungry too. I'm so hungry, but there's only snow around me. Maybe I should try to cook it? It's gonna be tasty. Olaf put some snowballs on a string to get a crispy crust. The snowman wasn't expecting the snow to melt so quickly. Oh, I'm hungry again. Oh. Suddenly, he heard the mountain trembling. Ah, a monster, save yourselves. The marshmallow just wanted to say hi, but Olaf got scared and ran away. This styrofoam heart will come in handy. Let's transform this old dinosaur toy. Glue pieces to the back. Add more styrofoam. Install a head with an open mouth. And keep covering it with styrofoam. The giant is standing on massive paws. Mix light clay. His face looks really intimidating. Give it a monster shape. Oh, an angry mouth and huge paws look so scary. Spray paint it white and highlight marshmallow with blue acrylic paint. Giant Marshmallow lives in an ice castle, guarding it from unwanted guests. He's really huge and scary, but he's only tough on the outside. <laughs> 
His heart is full of kindness, but not many people want to approach him. The guys finally got to Elsa's castle. Let's hide behind an ice block so he doesn't notice us. And Sven starts snacking on Olaf's snowball. Hey! Attack! The two friends threw snowballs at the monster. Elsa heard the roar and came out. Who hurt my baby? Elsa! Anna, how did you find me? Guys, you're all here. Anna hugged Elsa and her frozen heart melted. Love saves the day. Separate toothpicks into parts and install them on a square lid. Checked fabric will complete the basket. Cover it from the inside. The handle is here too. We just need to get some food. Anna and Olaf decided to have a picnic. They were sitting and talking in the fall garden. It's so great here, right? Uh-huh. Pumpkins and leaves are as good as the snow. <laughs> they had a snack together. Hmm. Shall we sing our song? When all that's around us is changing, our hearts strengthen and grow every day. What matters is that we're sustaining our friendship in each possible way. So come on, gang, let's all go together and be one happy family. We can turn some fabric into a triangular scarf. Decorate it. Blue fringe decorates the sides. Snap! Trim the tassels. A scarf will always make Anna and Elsa warm with their mother's love. Anna came into her sister's room. Elsa, what happened? Why are you sad? Oh, Anna, if only you knew. These voices, I hear singing. Aw, let's lie down and hug like we used to do. Mm. Anna is quietly singing their mother's song. Surrounded by ice, there's a place where destiny tells you to go. Make a water bottle. Make pieces of the right size out of thin artificial leather. Cover plastic with a case we made. This sealed flask won't spill a drop. The travelers got tired as they were walking around the forest. Everyone was hot. Anna took out a flask, but it was empty. Where can I get water? Water? I'm so thirsty. Water! Suddenly, everyone looked at Olaf. Hmm, I don't like this idea. The sun melted the snowman a little, and the friends were able to fill their flask. Olaf, you saved everyone. You're our hero. Thanks for agreeing to help. Whoa. The wind blew the sheets of colored paper away. It's really fall. Mark a spiral on a styrofoam circle. A small hole punch worked hard on a whole pile of papers. Wind is blowing the papers away. Mix yellow and red acrylic paint to make orange and paint the top. It's a real fall storm, woo! The friends came through a magic forest. Olaf got lost. Anna, Elsa. Kristoff, Sven, Samantha. <laughs> Wait, I don't even know a Samantha. Suddenly, a whirl of leaves appeared nearby. Huh? Looks like Olaf became friends with the wind. They'll always have fun together. Wee! Olaf! The wind brought him to his friends. Anna, look, the wind likes your red hair. Really? <laughs> I got an invisible admirer. <laughs> A ball of clay turns into a tiny salamander figurine. Smooth it with a modeling tool. The salamander got into a mud puddle. A magic brush painted it blue. 
This blue-eyed amphibian with sparkly skin is shining in the starlight. The salamander lives in a fiery forest. Elsa couldn't walk through the fire flames. As soon as she managed to put the fire out, the salamander lit it up again. The fight could go on forever, but the salamander was trapped. Wait, baby, don't be scared of me. I won't hurt you. I just want to be friends. The salamander was nervous, but it came out. And soon Elsa managed to become friends with the amphibian. <laughs> there are rare items in this chest. Anna found something interesting. Give it to us, Lalalu will take a closer look. Hmm, it looks like an old map. Let's keep it well hidden. Trim the straw. Make a scroll and put it inside. There is a silk cord on the sides and a bow in the middle. Anna got the most precious of all treasures. Take care of this map. The girls reached the shore. Wow. What do you think? Is that the ship? I think so. Singing led us here. The sisters went to look at the ship. We need to look around. Achoo! Everything is covered in dust. Anna managed to find a scroll surrounded by spider webs and broken furniture. Wow. Open it, let's see. I can't believe it. This is a map of Arendelle. <gasps> There's more here. Olaf shook it and a letter and a photo of the girl's parents fell out. They want to find out more about Elsa's magic and find some answers. Elsa started crying. <laughs> Memories of their parents are so painful to them. <laughs> it's so nice to touch this soft white plush fabric. Add magic and voila! A piece for a pillow is ready. Add hot glue to the sides and make a pillow. Fill it with light synthetic stuffing snowballs. Make eyes out of colorful felt. A carrot nose will be in the middle. Smile! Let's take a selfie to capture this moment. A pointy tuft made out of a pipe cleaner was created by the same hairdresser that did Olaf's hair. It's uncanny. <laughs> Mary is so tired. She's had a busy day. All she wants to do now is sit on the couch. So she flopped down. Who was left here? An Olaf-shaped pillow. Wow, it's soft and nice. So cute. I love this snowman. I feel better. A couple of pictures later, the girls were so focused on watching their favorite movie. Well, are you ready for battle? <laughs> you betcha. Coloring in frozen characters as fast as you can is a great battle. Let's take crayons and start. But suddenly, Mary's crayons got too dull. Hey, I can't keep going. I need to sharpen my yellow crayon. And I need a blue one. Let's forget about it and watch the movie one more time. <laughs> this plastic horse needs some care. Trim the mane. Clean it. And paint the face blue. Paint the body the same color. Cover the ears with clear nail polish and sprinkle the sticky layer with glitter. This water spirit looks like a beautiful horse. Since Elsa became the guardian of the magic forest, a water spirit called the Knot follows her <laughs> everywhere. Glue a printed control panel of a robot vacuum cleaner to an old eyeshadow palette. This device will come in handy. Wrap it with a foam paper ribbon and cover the attachment points with glitter. It's the latest model. It's decorated with amber and it has gold wheels. You can forget about cleaning. The Roomba will do everything for you. <sighs> you know, honey, let's give Olaf a day off. I think the Roomba will do a great job. And that's true. This miraculous device easily collects extra bills. What a great assistant. Olaf has competition. 